The Midnight Studio Episode 2. Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into Episode 2 of The Midnight Studio. Buckle up, because things are getting spooky and a whole lot more complicated. Remember how Hanbaum stumbled upon The Midnight Studio in the first episode? Well, in Episode 2, she gets even closer to the ghostly action. Investigating a strange light downstairs, she walks right into Kiju's secret world. Now, she's definitely alive, although Kiju entertains the possibility for a hilarious moment, but here's the thing, Kiju is supposed to be the only living human who can open the door from this side. This, along with another strange encounter in an elevator, makes Han Baum a very interesting person in Kiju's eyes. Seems like she might have some hidden abilities. Kiju's suspicions grow stronger when his next client, a child ghost, seeks refuge in the tent Han Baum sets up outside her old apartment. Here's the twist. Hanbaum can see the child ghost too. This piques Kiju's interest even further, leading to a lunch date that's both heartwarming and a little sad. It's clear Kiju hasn't shared a meal with another human in a long time. Hanbaum, ever the kind soul, offers to be his regular eating buddy. The child ghost's last wish? To track down a limited edition toy sword. Kiju embarks on a hilarious shopping adventure, facing down tantrums and sold out stores before finally finding the sword at a festival. But when he brings it back, things take another unexpected turn. The child ghost vanishes with the sword, leaving Kiju confused. However, the plot thickens when Kiju finds the ghost hanging out with Hanbaum. Hold on, what? Apparently, there's more to the story. Turns out, the ghost has a living twin brother. We have a case of mistaken identity here. The older twin, the ghost, died tragically while trying to buy the sword as a birthday present for his younger brother. They're orphans, and the younger brother is about to be adopted by a family in the US. That explains why he felt comfortable with Hanbaum, who volunteers at the orphanage. Kiju delivers the sword and convinces the living brother to say goodbye to his ghostly sibling at the midnight studio. They throw a bittersweet birthday party for both boys, a heartwarming moment amidst all the spookiness. Despite the connection with Hanbaum, Kiju feels a pang of disappointment. He thought she might be special, able to see ghosts. But that night, everything changes. Kiju is attacked by a horde of creepy, ghosts. Just when all hope seems lost, Hanbaum appears out of nowhere. Here's the jaw-dropping part, Hanbaum pulls Kiju out of the ghost's grasp, and they land inside a shimmering force field. What is this power Hanbaum possesses? Is she more than just a lawyer with a kind heart? Episode 2 left us with more questions than answers. Can Hanbaum see ghosts after all? What's the deal with the ghosts and Hanbaum's mysterious power? Stay tuned for the next episode where we hopefully unravel some of these mysteries. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more K-drama recaps and theories, and let me know in the comments what you think is going on with Hanbaum. The Midnight Studio Episode 1 In a world where the line between the living and the dead is blurred, one man holds the key to unlocking the secrets of the afterlife. Welcome to The Midnight Studio, where every photograph captures more than just memories. Meet Seo Kiju, inheritor of a cursed legacy, cursed with the ability to see ghosts and capture their final moments on film. His photo studio isn't just a business, it's a portal between worlds. But the origins of this curse trace back centuries, to a nobleman who dared to steal from the Grim Reaper himself. A father's desperate plea for his son's life unwittingly condemned generations to a fate of ghostly encounters. Alongside Seo Kiju are his loyal companions, Assistant Ko and Bek Nam Gu, ghosts themselves, bound to his service. Together, they navigate the perilous realm between life and death. But when a vengeful spirit disrupts their peace, they're forced to find a new sanctuary. And in a twist of fate, Kiju crosses paths with Hanbaum, an attorney with a penchant for the paranormal.
As they join forces to assist a grieving couple, Hanbom discovers the hidden depths of Kiju's studio, unveiling a world she never knew existed. But as she delves deeper into the mysteries surrounding Kiju and his spectral companions, she may find herself questioning her own reality. In The Midnight Studio, every photograph tells a story, and every encounter brings them one step closer to unlocking the secrets of the past. Join us on this thrilling journey where the line between the living and the dead is blurred, and the truth lies within the shadows of the night. Subscribe now for more episodes of The Midnight Studio. Grigo, 간절한 이들.